Bon Johnny, sock means bon apps. Okay, so I'm well rested. I'm back to show you the remainder of the new Star Atlas showroom. We've got the dogfighting and racing arenas. Now, this is where you can train your skills and gain a rank on the leaderboard. I'm not entirely sure if the leaderboard is working correctly at the moment. Um, seems to give me some strange results sometimes, but whatever. They'll sort it out soon. So let's uh, start with the racing because that's a little bit more laid back. We're not on a timer uh, like at, at the start. I'll show you. Um, I'm still kind of working around with the mouse and keyboard. Um, my my Hotas setup is kind of like you know like here, let's say, uh, and my mouse and keyboard is kind of like here. Uh, oh, if you can understand that, uh, yeah, it's a bit awkward, but whatever. We'll just get through it. You can see I changed the character. This is a repair guy kind of character, and in the seasonal uh, skin, looks cool. Uh, I mean, fantastic, really. Fantastic details. It's, it's <laughs> Unreal Engine 5 is just amazing. So here we are. We're on this kind of uh, asteroid uh, depot uh, station. I don't know what this is. And the idea is we mount our Pierce X4 and then we go and do a race circuit around. I can't jump off. <laughs> around this asteroid belt here. It looks beautiful, looks stunning. So let's mount the Pierce X4. Just look at it. Beautiful. You see that when you. There, it shuts down. You see the, uh, the, the kind of the uh, ripply heat. Uh, signature that comes out of it when we approach it it turns on handlebars come out heads up display comes up engine is on there you get that ripply effect amazing details let's get on it all right and i'm gonna change the camera to first person uh we go to flight mode pressing h flight mode there we go. And you can see on the left of the uh, heads up display here, I'm changing the speed uh, limiter. Let's have it here. Uh, well, no, let's just go max. Let's just go max. All right. So all I do now is... Whoa, okay, this is a bit fast. All I do now is just approach this, and then we start the racetrack. So let's just get to it. Whoa. Whoa. Oh dear, I missed it all already. I'm going to turn down that limiter a little bit. Whoa. Oh, hit the asteroid. So what would be nice is if on the heads-up display it showed where the gate is, the next gate. Because now I have to look around. I can shoot that whilst I'm here. Uh, and then find the next gate and it just takes more time it'd be much better if that were, that gate was kind of um, detailed on the heads up display oh dear, oh dear I'm terrible uh, right yeah so now I'm looking around trying to find this gate again there it is Man, I'm doing dreadfully. Ah, oh, what the? Yeah, okay. Now it's getting annoying, actually. Star Atlas. So hopefully you can uh, you can put the next gate kind of uh, arrow signature on the heads up display. Show me where it is, because look at this. I can't find it anywhere. And yeah, look. Right. So I'll change camera. Like, where, where is it? Yeah, so there you go. So now I'm, now I'm just completely lost. And now what do I do? Uh, I'm going to try and find the uh, back to like the, the main kind of station, the start point. Maybe if I just zoom out a bit. And look down. Oh, there it is. Look, let's just start it. I don't know if you can even start again, to be honest. Let's press R and see what happens. Yes, hold R. Okay, there we go. So, we'll start again. Oh, 
Now this is cool, look. You see how this, uh, this large part of the asteroid is being held on by ties, uh, by like a, a net. Let's see, let's see what's inside it. Oh, it looks like some resource deposits. Hey, that's cool, isn't it? Now, if I press down the uh, middle mouse button, I change to tractor beam. Okay, it doesn't look like I can gather any resources right now. That's cool, it's like a gigantic geode. Alright, we'll give this one more try and then we'll go on to the dogfighting. All right, let's go. Let's go, guys. Yeah, it's a good start. Oh. a little bit of practice this, doesn't it? <laughs> God, let's just try and do some cool manoeuvres. Yeah. Whoa. Came out of nowhere. Not bad, not bad. 51 seconds. Okay, well, it can certainly do a lot better than that. Uh, but there we go, that's it. So I, I started, to, started to warm up a bit there. So what we'll do now is go back to the main menu and we'll go on to the uh, dogfighting mode. All right. Dogfight. So this one, it starts instantly. So you, you just plunge straight into it. So you need to get on board your X4. So this is for training up our combat pilots. Looking forward to seeing how the uh, leaderboard develops with this one. And I'm going to go to uh, first person view again. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, I pressed V, which uh, V joy. Okay, so it's starting. So on the heads-up display, we should see a enemy come in. There we go. So it means it's above us. There we go. So I'll press T to track and attack. There we go. And switch to tractor beam. There we go. Okay, so wave two should start now. Enemies inbound. I'll just keep on the move so they can't shoot me. Let's get out of here. Should we try a rocket? Okay, the rocket's just fire straight. Ah, you can see I'm almost dead, actually. <laughs> oh, dear. So let's go... Uh, I'll put shields to max, and you can see now the shields are regenerating. Now if I go uh, power to max hull, see what happens. Okay, nothing happens there, so you can't regenerate your hull. on max to regenerate the shields. Press T to track that target. OK, 
Okay, now I'm going to put weapons on Max. I'm fighting a Opal Jet Jet here. And there he goes. I need to uh, put my shields back. Don't think I'm going to survive this one very well. Okay, this is a PSX, uh, PS F4. So I need to get out of here. I need to do some sneaky maneuvers. Get in the asteroids. You can come and follow me. Whilst my shields regenerate. But there we go, that was fun. And uh, with a bit of practice, uh, yeah, I'm sure we'll get up to wave four. <laughs> but that's it. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, and I'll just keep practicing. And uh, I'll let you know if I can get uh, to, like, I don't know. I don't know what the waves go to, to be honest. But, uh, well, I'd be lucky to see wave four, to be honest, won't I? But there we go, that's it. Looks stunning. Looks beautiful. Love it. And, uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing how the leadboard develops. Ciao for now. <laughs>